pandemic has certainly hit nonprofits very hard as one fundraiser after the other is canceled. Eyewitness News reporter Mark Hiller shares the plight of one of those nonprofits known for helping domestic animals in distress. One day each summer, this pavilion at McDade Park is typically packed with people to help an organization which helps dogs in distress. Because it didn't happen this year, the organization is improvising to get a much needed financial lifeline from the community. If there's one thing Elaine Doherty loves to do, it's taking her five-year-old West Highland White Terrier named Stewie for walks. She loves it almost as much as he does. He loves life. He loves to be around animals. He loves to be around dogs. He's been around plenty of pooches in recent years at Tracy's Hope Annual Pet Walk at McDade Park, but not this year. We've had to cancel at least three or four different uh, fundraisers this year. With next to no donations coming in, the Duryea-based nonprofit found itself down to its last $100. We really uh, are kind of um, fearful that we're not going to have any more money to, to pay for anything. So it's, we pray a lot. <laughs> This is Natasha. Tracy's Hope is perhaps best known for harboring about a half dozen sick dogs seized nearly a decade ago in the John Tannis animal cruelty case in Muzik. Those dogs required veterinary care, as do eight dogs currently housed by the organization. We have not been able to do any um, pay our, our vet bills. Tracy's Hope is counting on a Labor Day weekend car show to cure some of its financial ills. Funds are running very low and the animals need our help. Chelsea Zangaya is doing more than entering her 2000 Volkswagen Beetle she calls Ladybug. She's coordinating the car show for a cause. I love the animals. I love the people that it brings together. And it's just a great organization. You don't need to enter a car to enjoy the car show. There'll be plenty to do at McDade Park, from basket raffles and 50-50 drawings to trophies, door prizes, and even a food truck. Just make sure you bring your mask for safety's sake. And oh yeah, dogs are welcome too. In Scranton, Mark Hiller, Eyewitness News. Mark, thanks. Tracy's Hope Car Show is happening Saturday, September 5th, from noon until 4 at McDade Park. Head over to pahomepage.com to learn much more about participating or helping out the nonprofit.